I can't really remember saying that. Yes, I do remember. You did say that in the arena. Hey guys, last week in the Big Brother Danger House was a week of activities. Like, it was so fun. The housemen are now beginning to step up their game. They are now beginning to wake up to realize that this Big Brother Danger is a game. So guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Girl Modupe Eto. If this is your first time of coming across my channel, you are most definitely welcome back to my channel. If you are an old subscriber, returning viewer, you all are all welcome back to my channel. So guys, last week I was not around like i didn't give you guys any gist because of some certain reasons but for now i'm actually back with the full vibe and i'm going to give you guys back to back every day about what's happening in the big brother ninja house so don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not and click the notification bell to get notified when i upload a new video oh my god guys let's talk about the eviction show of yesterday yes so guys um like something happened during the week I need to address before we move to the eviction show so during last week um last week like praise has been so sweet he has actually been so sweet there's one favorite thing i like about praise is he tends to take care of lecon i know he's not his duty to take care of lecon in the house but since lecon said he doesn't know how to cook for some time praise have been the one taking care of lecon's food Praise and Neo have been the one, and V and some other housemates actually have been the one taking care of um, Lakers food, like cooking, and they will give to Lakers to eat. Because Big Brother called him and told him he was reducing, he's getting, he's not eating well. So um, Lakers started. He now told Big he doesn't know how to cook and other things. But right now Lakers is not eating well. So one good thing about Praise when Praise was in the house last week was that praise was actually cooking for leko which i actually love so much like that's what that's how it's supposed to be so guys um like it's still a shock to me how praise was being evicted from the house like i'm still in a shock and i actually miss praise because he's a good dancer and it's always even during the party on saturday night praise was there he's always giving his best in all the arena games that they were always playing praise is always the one winning the game like i never expected it <laughs> i never expected that praise was going to go i'm still in shock so let's talk about the eviction show ebuka shake the table he shake the table. <laughs> I didn't hear loud. Like, Ebuka shake the table yesterday. I'm bright, oh man. If I was to be bright, oh, what Ebuka asked me that yesterday? If it was to be me, Ebuka asked that question. I swear. I was like, God, I want to go home. Because Ebuka shake the table. Yes, he shake the table. He asked Brighto one question. He said, Brighto was telling um, Kid Wire that um, Neo is a fake housemate. Like, Neo is pretending in the house. Like Neo, he's fake, his characters and everything are fake. And that Brighton was actually telling Kid Wire that. You know Bright there, Bright, it's not as if Bright can talk, but I feel that is his own strategy of gaining popularity and still staying in the house up to today because everybody keeps talking about Brighton and that he's evil character so that is his strategy like yes it's a game so everybody have to have their own strategy. Brighton's strategy is to always Try to gum two people's heads together, make somebody to quarrel or something like that. So Brighto spit, he spitted about um praise getting married to a 60 years old lady. And not just that, he also called Neo a fake housemate. Like Neo is pretending in his character. So he can shake the table yesterday. And Brighto was like, I don't know. I never said that. And Ebuka was, do you want to say I'm lying? And Brighto was, I never said that, like, I don't know, I, I can't remember saying such. But we all know that Brighto actually said this. He told Kid Wire that Neo was actually pretending in the house. So, guys, let's move on to Lucy on the vision show. Yeah, Lucy. Everyone can also shake the table by asking Lucy, what is the connection? between um praise and her and she was like oh ebuka i know you were going to say something like that i was already expecting that from you and she was like nothing she's just comfortable with praise and everything but me i know that lucy actually liked praise because from everybody in the house one of the two persons that she's close to after catching her left the house was 
Praise and Dorothy. So, man, she's not feeling it. She's feeling, she's actually not feeling too well because of this whole praise eviction. So, guys, I can shake the table and yeah, and also Erica Azor got a strike and V they actually got a Anthony but they got a strike from Big Brother two. Um, the, um, Erica got a two strike. Also got one. V is V V and totally bad. I think the both of them got one one. If I'm not mistaken. So um oh my god, like when the news was announced that um Erica got two strike, man, I felt I felt for her because <laughs> one mistake and you are gone. You are out of the house. You are actually out of the house. So she got a strike and even Kid Wire. And he was also trying to console her, talking, 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 and everything. But before the eviction show, during the week, um, Erica and Leko actually discussed because Leko has been avo avoiding Erica for a quite for a, for some time now. Like he has been avoiding her because of his emotions and he loves her and seeing her with another man, he did pay now. It a pain now. So he the best thing Leko could do was to avoid Erica for some time. And I and Erica had to confront Leko on a particular day. I'm sorry I couldn't remember the day. So Erica confronted Leko and told Leko that she doesn't like the aspect that Leko is avoiding her, even when she tries to talk to Leko. And Leko, you know, Leko, Leko is a guy, he has sense, wisdom over wisdom, a warrior. <laughs> so Leko had to talk to her and then uh, Set to the differences. So when Biggie gave Erica a strike, Erica is now angry. Went to Leo, started reporting to Leo that Leko couldn't come to her to console her. And I'm like, why will Leko have to come to you to console you? You have your man already. You have Kid Wire. Since you are physically attracted to Kid Wire and you are mentally attracted to Leko, you can't come and use Leko for free like that. So, eh, eh. Your man should do the two. Your man that you are physically attracted to should be the one to console you. And you should also try to be mentally attracted to him. Oh Lord, we're like, I've never seen such before when someone is physically and mentally attracted. Man, please, you people should be physically and mentally attracted to me. Like, I need you guys watching me right now to be physically and mentally attracted to me. <laughs> please. What I mean is like, by subscribing to my channel, you'll be physically, and you also be mentally attracted to me. Don't just do what, don't be physically attracted to me alone. Please, be mentally, do the two together to help my life. So guys, Erica was actually angry for the fact that um, Leko did not come and console her and everything. But you all know Leko, Leko is a kind of emotional person, and I'm not going to blame him for that aspect of him not going to console Erica. Like, during the diary section of today, during the diary section of today, um, Lucy expressed how, like, she felt so bad for praise leaving the house. What I'm really talking about, Lucy, is because I feel her pain. It's not as if everybody in the house are not her friends, but there's what is called understanding. It's difficult to understand somebody, and when you find that person that can understand you, I swear you don't want to let that person to go. Lucy is a good person at the same time, but... I feel the house may not really understand her based on she's always shouting and nagging and everything. But I hope she still gets a new friend in the house. We are still hoping that new housemates are still going to come in to give the to give us the vibe to shake the house and everything. Guys, before I leave this place, Watoni and Brighto, what's going on? Who can tell me? Leave your comment in the comment section below. Tell me what's what's happening. We see Brighto and then Watoni. Please tell me. I want to know. Like, <laughs> well, guys, Watoni and Brighto are now kind of their ship have not shipped, but I feel Watoni is making more effort. During last week, Brighto fingered Watoni. Yes, it's how they do VSO. So I feel for a guy to finger a girl, that means himself. He has something he wants to. Maybe he has feelings for Watoni too. So Watoni and Brighto, I don't know what they are shipping, but they are shipping soon. Ship, hopefully. Ozo and Nengi, guys. Ever since that day that Ozo actually took, became the head of house, and he took Dorati. From that week to today, 
Ozo and Nengi's love has been like this. Kolebaje, you can't separate them. Like the two of them are actually inseparable. They are doing this together. Ozo goes to feed Nengi, give her food on the bed. They are wearing almost too much. They are always wearing clothes almost too much. But it's always a coincidence. But they are always wearing clothes almost too much. And they are always doing things together, eating together, playing together, talking together. They are doing a lot of things together. But I don't know why the ship has not shipped her up to now. We are still hoping that they actually ship her. So guys, the four people that was being nominated for the the four of them that stood up for the eviction were actually we have neo <laughs> sorry guys we have v we have v we have tricky t we have watonia we have praise praise seems to be the lowest of all like the votes for praise was actually low but at the same time ebuka made it known to us that if two housemates if their votes were the same thing, the head of house have the right to actually um, choose one person. And last week, head of house was Kid Wire. So Kid Wire actually chose praise. I'm so confused because I felt since Erica and Watoni are not in good terms and everything, I felt Kid Wire was going to choose Watoni. But I'm so shocked that Kid Wire chose praise to go out of the house like it's still a shock to me and when he was asked why he said well, because he said um, praise likes likes um causing confusion between two people i don't know how he put that statement but he just said something like that so guys tell me what you think about praise leaving the house if you are happy with the fact that praise have actually left the house and Tell me also, what do you think about White, uh, Watoni and Vaito, their ship? If it's going to ship, and what do you think about Ozo and um, Ozo and Nengi? Like, what's really going on? Tell me in the comment section below. Do you really want Ozo and Nengi, their ship, to ship very well? Like, for them to, you know. <laughs> Tell me what you think in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not. And press notification bell to always get notified when I upload a new video. And I also have interesting videos on my channel. Minus Big Brother Ninja Plus, Big Brother Ninja. I have other interesting videos on my channel. So don't forget to go and watch them out. Thanks for watching my video. Bye.